Hey y'all, Mike here from All American Reviews, and today I'm talking about how to find grills made in the USA. Grilling and barbecuing is a staple of American culture, and having the right equipment to cook is essential. These days, there are a lot of different types of grills to choose from, whether it's gas, charcoal, ceramic, wood pellet, or something else entirely. It can be really difficult to find high quality brands that are making their grills in the USA. Today, we're gonna to cover all of those categories. I'm going to talk about how to spot grills that are made in the USA, my top picks for American-made grills, and make sure to stick around to the end of the video where we'll be answering some frequently asked questions. I've also written about this exact same topic before, so check in the description below for a link to that article. And if you're passionate about buying American-made products, give this video a like, subscribe to our channel, and make sure to head over to allamericanreviews.com. There you'll find a ton of research and buying guides on shopping American-made. All right, let's get into today's video on how to find grills made in the USA. First up, let's cover how to spot grills made in the USA. Now, like I mentioned earlier, there are a ton of different types of grills to choose from, and some are more likely to be made in the USA than others, depending on the materials that are in that product and where they are sourced. Let's start with stainless steel, which is a pretty popular product for a lot of different components of the grill. Stainless steel is often used for the main shell of the grill, the burner, the grill grate, and a bunch of other components. Now, if y'all have watched some of my videos on tools and other products, you know that steel quality can vary greatly depending on where it is sourced. We know that Chinese steel is three times weaker and more prone to defects than American steel. So just make sure to watch out for where it is sourced. Let's move on to ceramic. Ceramic is essentially clay and it is a great material to use for grilling because of its ability to heat up quickly to high temperatures, sustain low temperatures, and it's just super versatile and can last a really long time if you take care of it. Since it's just clay, it can be pretty much sourced from anywhere, and it's often referred to as Kamado cooking. Now in Kamado cooking, the big boy in this category is big green egg. Contrary to popular belief though, big green eggs are actually not made in the United States. They're actually made in Mexico. Kamado Joe is another popular pick in Kamado cooking category, and they are actually made in China. But don't worry though, I'm gonna go over my top pick for ceramic grills a little bit later in this video. All right, we've covered steel and ceramic. Let's get to cast iron. Cast iron is another popular material for grill grates in particular because of its ability to retain heat. You may know some popular brands in cast iron like Lodge, who's famous for their cast iron skillets. Now, cast iron is pretty cheap to manufacture, so there's actually a lot of really good options for sourcing this material in the USA. And finally, porcelain is another big material that y'all will probably hear thrown around. A lot of grills will have a porcelain enameled coating that basically just helps create a non-stick surface and helps with longevity. I don't particularly like porcelain enameled grills though. I think they're prone to chipping and it really decreases your ability for heat retention. I've also found that a lot of manufacturers who use porcelain enameled grills are making the rest of their components overseas. That's not to say that there are any good American-made options though. You just have to make sure to do your research. So there's obviously a lot of different components that go into making a grill. So this is a category in particular where we have to be super careful about how a brand uses made in the USA language if they use it at all. Make sure to watch out for those qualifiers like assembled in the USA or made in the USA with imported materials. And like I mentioned in previous videos, we also have Title 19, Chapter 4, Section 1304 of the United States Code on our side, which basically just says if a product is primarily imported, that it must be labeled as such on the physical product. Now, unfortunately, that doesn't necessarily apply to marketing materials. So if you aren't staring the product straight in the face, then make sure to give the brand a call or you can head over to All American Reviews and we potentially have done the research for you. I cover all of these tips and more in my full video on how to tell if a product is made in the USA, so make sure to give that a watch if you haven't already, I'll link it in the description below. All right, now that we've covered some tips on finding grills made in the USA, let's get into my top picks for American made grills. Now there are a ton of great grill brands made in the USA and more than I have time to cover in today's video. So make sure to check out our full research on the best grills made in the USA on All American Reviews, which I've linked to in the description below. First up is Hasty Bake. Hasty Bake is one of our top picks for charcoal grills, and in particular, their Legacy 131 powder coated charcoal grill. They're based in Tulsa, Oklahoma, and the Legacy 131 is one of their most popular models. 
I think this grill is super versatile and in grilling heat control is key. Now this grill has a pretty cool lifting mechanism where you can actually lower or raise your coals to the desired distance away from your food. So if you're looking for a really good charcoal grill, I think Hasty Bake is a great option. Next up is the Cook Shack PG500 Pellet Grill. Cook Shack is based in Ponza City, Oklahoma, and their PG500 grill is one of my favorite wood pellet grills. Now, if you've cooked with a fancy wood pellet grill before, you know that these grills are automated, which is great for heat control. This Cook Shack PG500 also has a few different cooking zones, both for direct and indirect heat. So, if you're looking for a good wood pellet grill similar to the likes of Traeger and Green Mountain, more on them later, I think Cook Shack is a great option. Next is American made grills, specifically their muscle grills. If you're looking for a good built-in option, these grills are really hard to beat. You can cook with a bunch of different fuel types on American muscle grills, but I think it's just a good gas grill option in particular. A bit expensive, but if you're splurging for a big outdoor kitchen, the muscle grills from American made grills are a solid choice. Next is Primo Ceramic Grills. All right, so for those of y'all who are looking for an American-made alternative to the Big Green Egg or Kamado Joe, these guys are it. Primo Ceramic Grills is based in Belleville, Illinois, and is making some great grills for Kamado cooking. They have a bit of a unique oval shape versus the typical taller round egg shape of the Big Green Egg, but it's still great for both direct and indirect heat. So if you're looking for a really good ceramic grill option, check out Primo Grills. And the last brand I'll cover today is Yoder Smokers. We're talking about grilled and barbecuing today, so y'all know that I had to include some smokers in this list. Yoder Smokers is based in Hutchinson, Kansas, and is making wood, pellet, and charcoal varieties. And let me tell you all, these things are tanks. They'll do custom builds as well, so if you're looking for a good competition smoker, definitely check out Yoder Smokers. Now, let's get to some frequently asked questions. First up, are Weber grills made in the USA? And the answer is no, we actually didn't find a single Weber grill that is close to 100% made in the USA. They actually had a bit of a fallout in 2012 with the made in the USA label on their products. So for more on that class action lawsuit and other details on Weber, we have a full write up on them on All American Reviews, which I've linked to in the description below. Next, are Traeger grills made in the USA? And the answer is no, these popular wood pellet grills are no longer made in the USA. They are now manufactured in China, which is a switch that they made after they sold the company in 2006. We also have a full write up on Traeger, which I've linked to below. And lastly, are Green Mountain grills made in the USA? And the answer is no, similar to Traeger, Green Mountain grills and their popular wood fired pellet grills are now manufactured in China. We also have a full write up on Green Mountain grills, which I've linked to below. That's it for this video on how to find grills made in the USA. If y'all have any questions, feel free to drop a comment below or shoot us a message at All American Reviews and we'll find out for you and write something up. And if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and thanks for supporting your country and shopping American made. See y'all next time.